the most powerful weapons ever made to date. War has always been a major driver of technological progress, but it has only been in the last century that we have developed weapons that can cause mass destruction or inflict new levels of physical and mental pain. There is never a valid reason to support going to war, but some of the following weaponry is undeniably remarkable. But before we get started, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to stay updated. And now, let's just get into the list. Number 8. Iranian Shahed Suicide Drones Yes, these are drones specifically programmed to blow themselves up on impact. Currently, Russia uses these drones in their battles in Ukraine as the Ukrainian forces have found debris that points to these specific weapons. Shahed Aviation Industries, a company with a long experience in drone research, manufactures this drone. The company also developed the popular Shahed-129, a Predator clone. The Shahed-149, the Iranian counterpart of the larger Reaper, and the stealthy Shahed-181 and 191 drones. The drones are mostly used to disrupt ground troops advancing, attack military convoys or supplies. It is not the most efficient tool, but a very powerful weapon as the handlers select a target and the drones do their thing. Number 7. Schwere Gustav The German 80cm railway gun known as the Schwere Gustav was a massive piece of artillery built to fire from a railroad car. It was created by Krupp of Essen as artillery in the late 1930s, with the specific intention of destroying the French Maginot Line's key forts during a siege. These were the most powerful fortifications in use at the time. Gustav was capable of firing 7-ton shells 47 kilometers away. The Schwerer Gustav was about 1,350 tons when fully completed. This piece of artillery was created by the Germans in anticipation of the Battle of France. When the fight started, the greatest cannon of World War II was not prepared for war. The Maginot Line static defenders were quickly outflanked and isolated by the Wehrmacht's Blitzkrieg onslaught in Belgium, forcing them to capitulate without suffering any significant casualties and rendering the destruction of the fortifications unnecessary. Number 6. Nimitz-class Aircraft Carrier U.S. Nimitz-class. At over 1,000 feet, the aircraft carriers of the Nimitz-class are the largest warships in existence. They are also the most expensive, costing about $4.5 billion United States dollars each. Up to 90 aircraft can be stored on the 100,000-ton carriers, which are armed with anti-aircraft guns and missiles. They are anticipated to work for 50 years. The Gerald R. Ford class's successor, which will be considerably larger and cost about $12 billion, is already being developed in the United States. Ten aircraft carriers from the Nimitz class are currently in use by the U.S. Navy. The lead ship in the class bears the name of Fleet Admiral Chester W. Nimitz, who led the United States Navy's Pacific Fleet during World War II. Number 5. Chimera Virus An animal created from various animal parts, such as a hippogriff or a griffin, is known as a chimera in Greek mythology, which perfectly depicts this virus. The DNA of two or more different viruses can be combined to create a chimera virus. The Soviet Union experimented with them in the 1980s, introducing another virus genetic material into smallpox or other viruses to create chimeras. This procedure makes sure the new virus can propagate a completely distinct infection while retaining the aggressiveness and microscopic appearance of smallpox. This advancement in genetic engineering enables viral agents to avoid existing medications and immunizations, making them much more lethal. Number 4. Russia's Aviation Thermobaric Bomb of Increased Power Alexander Rukshin, Deputy Chief of the Russian General Staff, 
responded when asked about their recently created weapon, quote, all that is living nearly disappears. The Russians' aviation thermobaric bomb of increased power, also known as the father of all bombs, was successfully tested and launched in 2007. According to reports, the FOAP is four times as powerful as the largest non-nuclear bomb currently in use by the U.S. military, the GBU-43B, Massive Ordnance Air Bomb, sometimes referred to as the mother of all bombs, and officially designated with the name Moab. Number 3. R-36 ICBM one of the most potent surface missiles ever developed is the Intercontinental Ballistic Missile, and the R-36 is generally regarded as the largest of them all. Developed by the Russians during the Cold War, this weapon was feared by many Western officials because of its terrifying, destructive power. The R-36 served as the foundation for the family of cyclone launch vehicles. The final cyclone type under development Cyclone 4M is scheduled to launch from Kansas, Nova Scotia in 2023, as of early 2021. The RS-28 Sarmat, a new heavy ICBM, will replace Russia's R-36M. Some R-36 missiles have been modified to function as Nepper medium lift launchers, which can carry 4,500 kilograms into orbit. Number 2. The B-53 The last of its sort, before nuclear weapons began to produce relatively lower yields, this was one of the most potent nuclear weapons the American military had ever produced. There were hundreds of these produced at the time, and they were only in use for four years before being retired from service in 1976. The B-53 was never employed in a civilian context, but if it had, it's thought to have resulted in unprecedented destruction. Most of us are grateful that it didn't interfere with our lives, allowing us to watch television, play video games, and play games at online casinos in Sri Lanka. Number 1. The Tsar Bomba Unquestionably the most potent weapon in existence, thankfully no longer in use, is the Tsar Bomba. This nuclear warhead, developed and used by the USSR, has a yield of 50 megatons, which is greater than any weapon made since or after. It was tested towards the end of October 1960, far from any populated areas in northern Russia. The explosion that followed had a complete damage radius of around 35 kilometers and was so intense that witnesses claimed to have seen the light emanating up to 1,000 kilometers away. That was all for today, guys. If you are looking forward to more videos like this one, this is definitely the channel you should subscribe to. See you in the next video.